remain relevant in your profession, you have to ensure that you constantly develop yourself in it. When I was in secondary school many years ago, one of the subjects that we were taught was typewriting. And another one called shorthand. How many of you ever knew about that? <laughs> Praise the Lord. And those were two of the subjects I used to like very much. When it was time to go to the typing pool, it was always full of excitement for me. But what were the available equipment then in the typing pool? Typewriter. How many of you have ever seen a typewriter in your life? Not too many people. There were no internet then. There were no computers then. And what we had that was the highest then, Olympia typewriter. Amen? When you were typing in the typing pool then, you were hearing your neighbor. Pa, 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 pa. Pa, 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 pa. The noise. Amen. Praise God. The noise was so disturbing, but as I then, that was the highest that was available. But if you go to the market today, will you be able to get a trapeter to buy? No. There are several high-tech devices that have come in to play. And people keep improving and improving and improving over them, over and again. So when computers came on the scene, I had to sit down and use my basic knowledge of typewriter in the typing pool of many years ago to develop myself on how to be able to use the computer. Constantly developing yourself. 